since the season started, I've lost a lot. This is the sixth flooding I have. Sixth one. Right now, my fridge is on dropping everything in my dump. I think I don't move up to my mother upstairs right now. And where I'm living is very small. My mother only have one room upstairs. So now when me and my wife and teacher, it's very hard. And I tried. It's not that I didn't try to avoid it. I care as the dumps is I raised it six inches more when I moved in here. Right? So it's not that I came just like that and leave it and containing. I tried a lot. And there's a, how much I can do, I can't do much. I'm not a rich man. Well, this is in my downstairs. You can see everything is on prop, right? Boxes on the jazz bottle. This is my baby pram. This is the underground. If you can see here, I tried to put sun to stop it also. Nothing doing. This is my area of cooking. This does look what my cupboard look like underwater. This here. This is my room here that floods. So everything is on the bed. And yeah, I saw they clean the they clean the um the outfall. But that's not the cleaning the outfall is part of solving the problem. You have two shoes over here. Only one working, the other one is not working. This season I lost about maybe about one hundred sixty two heads up. We left about thirty or something. I know that there's a, we can't control the rainfall, right? But what we can do is to fix the the, the things that can cause the water to um, to flow out. If we're not fixing the sluice, then we're not getting anywhere. Because when you look at the news, you see the minister saying they're spending so many billions of dollars on drainage, and then to live under this um, circumstances doesn't make any sense.